I found her in the same spot that I find her every morning. Right there. <laughs> uh, what's on the schedule for today, my angel? We um, just go to the gym. Mm -hmm. I, have, I have to edit uh, the vlog from yesterday. Yep. We have to pick up Hannah's cake for her baby Ooh, shower. Ooh, that's like, that's, that's the big that's one. Like the ultimate. And, oh. and they don't, they've never made a cake like this before, so I have no idea how it's going to turn out. Alexa is going crazy getting some, um, some awesome, awesome merch and stuff together, shirts and tanks, and she's just killing guys, the game. Guys, I'm going crazy. <laughs> <laughs> you said Alexa's going crazy getting stuff together. Not like that. I mean like, like, <laughs> go, go, go. Hey, my angel, yeah. while I'm uh, going to edit right now, can you? Would you mind making me some, some brekkie brekkie? Brekkie brekkie? I already have it all prepared. Really? No, I'm gonna make it. <laughs> what are you gonna make? What do you want? Pancakes. I put my gym clothes on up because we're gonna be going to the gym in a little bit. But, um, sorry, my shoes are a little squeaky. This is actually yesterday's breakfast that got left upstairs, which is kind of yucky. Um, but I'm gonna make Carlos his special pancakes. I'm gonna make him a snack pancake something. You guys will see it. It's pretty easy, and they're really healthy and pretty good. Um, but first, we gotta let the pups out. Hey, girls. Hi, okay, come over here. Good girl, Sasha. Okay, so I just set the alarm off in the entire house as I was trying to do that. Um, literally, as I was walking down the stairs, Carlos is like, babe, don't forget the alarm is on. I was like, yeah, 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 okay. And then I got downstairs and I just opened the door anyway without turning off the alarm. That was a rookie move. It's gonna be a good day. Okay guys, I got really thrown off by the alarm this morning and the fact that I couldn't find baking soda that I totally forgot to video the process of how we make these pancakes. But it's super easy. Um, I literally get my little, like if you have like a food chopper upper thingy, like we have a ninja and a bullet or something like that. Um, and then I do cottage cheese, um, oats, and eggs. So one third, one third, one third, and a little bit of baking soda. And then you spin it all together and then you put it in your pancake maker, which these are totally ready to flip. Okay, let's see if they burned. Oh no, they're pretty. breakfasts in a row you are in a row they haven't actually been able to see the finished product so may you do the oh oh do the honors ba, 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 ba. look at that wow i'm very impressed my angel Thanks, baby. i'm halfway done with this vlog awesome. and then we can go to the gym what what <laughs> What happened? You were right. Yeah, but what was the whole thing? The whole thing was that... What did you think it was, babe? I thought it went, meow, but it just went, meow. You know what? I don't really understand what you're saying. How, how did you think it went? I don't want to say that again. What's wrong? wrong. It's a, uh, listen, <laughs> it's okay to be wrong, babe. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. Oh, I really do enjoy filmmaking. Uh, I directed an episode of Big Time Rush. I think the last season, uh, Big Time Tour Bus. Shout out to all you Big Time Rush fans. Um, I really have been enjoying kind of trying to find our style and our vibe in these vlogs. I love going back and watching vlogs from like two, three, four, four weeks ago because things are just evolving and changing as we go. I mean, yesterday's vlog, I started, you know, a little more um, experimenting with like time lapses at, at night and and just getting the GoPros there. And I'm just really excited to see where we're gonna be in like a year, a year from now. Especially with Little Ocean coming, I think we're gonna have uh, a lot of fun stuff to shoot. A lot of you guys have been asking if we're gonna continue uh, vlogging when the baby comes, and yeah, 100%. I think that's when it's gonna get really exciting. You know, we're not only gonna be. Uh, sitting here going through our day, but now we're gonna have this new little human who we're gonna get to hold in our hands and in our, in our arms, sorry, and uh, yeah, it's crazy. 
it, it, it really is crazy to think that in just a matter of two or three months, we're gonna be responsible for another life in this world. It's crazy. Okay, so here's the thing. I can just reserve it. It's a hundred dollars. I'll reserve it, and I don't think it, it's available for like a couple months. So then, I, so, so then I have to save up. So it does give you a couple months. How honestly, though, how long until you think it's available? I don't know. I'll call and ask. I'll call. Why now? Because here's the problem. Oh, it's Saturday. I can't. I'll call on Monday. Okay, you can't call on Monday because it's a holiday. I'll call on Tuesday. Um, here's the thing. You can totally reserve it, but if. It comes up in like two weeks that you have to buy this thing. You're gonna be pissed. I got it. Guys, check it out. She said I can get a board. She said I can get a boosted board. <laughs> this is the best day ever. Thanks, babe. I love you. Okay, so I have to call this lady from the bake shop to figure out what time I am picking up Hannah's cake. I'm Alexa. I ordered a cake and I wasn't sure what time I'm supposed to pick it up this evening. Thank you. Yes? Okay, perfect. And then, um, uh, if I come close, what time do you guys close just in case? Perfect, thank you so much. Bye-bye. So she told me that they close at 10 o'clock, but I have to pick up the cake between five or six. She's trying to get me to go earlier, but there's just no way, there's no time. It's already 2.30. So, um, babe, would yep. you like to gym? Gym. What do you what do you want to do? I'm gonna gym. Okay. Finally, I'm going to the gym. Vlogs are up. I'm going to the gym. All right. Are you gonna bike there? Uh. Chipotle type of guy. Babe, are you a Chipotle girl? Yeah, yeah I am, and I think Ocean's a Chipotle guy. Chip he's definitely a Chipotle guy. See, we don't actually call it Chipotle, we call it Chipotle. I think a lot of people call it Chipotle girls. No, I named it. It's Chipotle. So I got chicken, steak, and rice. Okay. And Lex got a oh my salad. Gosh, you're That's a lot of meat. Oh, yeah. Thank you very much, man. And we got a Chipotle reward card. Perfect. So we can just keep eating chipotle. Dude, awesome. Yeah, I know, bro. I know. Like that. Like that. Amazing. So I just... Carlos, she can see you videoing. I just sang to this woman over there, and she smiled, and then I said, I, I want to be your friend, and then she stopped looking at me. <laughs> Don't laugh. <laughs> I want to be your friend. Don't laugh. That's that's when you run. Oh, look at this. Look at this cake right here. That one looks amazing. I don't think any of these are ours. I'm, I I just want to see the pineapple. I want to see the pineapple, babe. I want to see the pineapple too. This place has like the craziest snacks. Look at this. It's like the prettiest. I want it all. Yeah. That looks amazing. Black and white chocolate cake with vanilla buttercream. Oh yes. my gosh. And I want that one too. 
Oh, uh, want it all. What, want what it all. Wow. This is a big box. So we don't want to open it. What if we just keep it a surprise until tomorrow? I kind of feel like we should just. I like it. You think? <laughs> Okay, then yeah, let's open it. He's really thinking? Let's open it. Because wait a minute, what if there's not a pineapple? What if it's What if it's the wrong thing in the box? It's totally. Totally, I'm gonna video this because I want to make sure that this survives the car. Thank you so much. No problem. <laughs> oh my gosh. Bye, thank you so much. Thank you. It would hate me tomorrow. Is it heavy? You know what? I know, right? Someone was like, we got Oh, pretty cakes. All right, babe, we got this. Nick, thank you. Thank you, Nick. Hannah, we got your cake. Here we go. Oh my gosh. So, basically the entire uh, party is in my hands right now. Actually. I'm genuinely afraid that it could tip. So, it could tip. I think it will be fine. But, we shall see. <laughs> Um, okay, I'm gonna go get the car ready. I'll meet you at the car. Cake. It was a very expensive cake. Uh, I shouldn't have put it down on the floor. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. What if the bottom gave way? That would be the worst. How are you gonna eat your burrito? I'm not. The cake is the priority. <laughs> babe, I'm so sorry. The cake is the priority, babe. Get in the car, let's do this. <laughs> We have just gotten home, and so Los. Far, no, no problems. I did hear something fall while we were in the car. Yikes. So, okay, so careful because there's like a little step. Oh my goodness. We have to open it and check it. We do. Holy wow, Carlos had to keep that on his lap the whole car ride over, which is really scary because we have to go to Orange County tomorrow and that drive is like an hour and a half. So, we have a long day ahead of us tomorrow. Okay, well, the good news is it still looks really great. The leaf is right there. We're good. Oh. oh, two leaves fell. Is it fixable? So we got it in, and we're. I, th I, th I think we're good. It closes. We just can't touch anything in there. It is about 9:15 ish or 9:30. Hi, Sasha. Uh, I'm about to let the dogs out to go potty. Sasha's getting. Oh, and Sydney's getting a little excited. Okay, hi. <laughs> they are ready to go. Sid, are you coming? So you know summer is ending around here when it starts getting really cold at night. Like before, I used to be in a tank top, no problem. Now it's a little bit nipply. Oh boy, they're in hyper mode right now. Come here. They are in hyper mode. I hope I can get them to get some energy out. Come on guys. I have to run them at night or else they'll never sleep. I'm worn out. I hope they are too. What's up guys? I uh, hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Um, man, what a day. <laughs> Carlos just called me annoying. Uh, only because she kept I pinching my annoying. nipple. Well, no, I didn't. I just said that I wanted to move this chair closer so that I could put my feet on it. You're like, uh, annoying. So, um, we had a crazy day today. 
We did a lot of stuff. The cake made it safely. Um, we lost a couple leaves. We lost a couple leaves. But it was great. Yeah. And uh, we also fell asleep last night, so we didn't get to uh, make you the the uh, outro from the bed. But you know what? We're just going to start doing it whenever we can. Yep. So here we are outside the next day talking about last night. Um, enjoying this beautiful view. Enjoy this beautiful view. Hold on. Just, let me just show you guys this beautiful view. Look at that. I feel very blessed today and every day. Okay, so uh, words of wisdom, babe. Um, I read, I don't remember, I don't know if it was Jesus Calling or Joyce Meyer, but... It was uh, Joyce Meyer, I think it was. Joyce Meyer's. Um, really interesting. She's talking about how, obviously the importance of prayer, but mm -hmm. how when we pray to God, we actually have the ability to change his mind about things that are going on. Really? And decisions that he makes for us. Um, and I thought that was really interesting. I, like I was that. like, wait, what? Like, what do you mean we can change God's mind? And, uh, they quoted... Oh, I don't remember if it was, I think it's in Exodus, um, but I don't know where in Exodus, um, but basically Moses is on Mount Sinai and he's talking with God and the people are rebelling down below because Moses has been gone for way too long and uh, God is furious with his people and he's basically like, he's like, I'm done with them, like I'm done. And Moses begs and pleads with God and he literally says, he's like, I believe that there can be change and I believe like I believe in these people and so should you and because of his heart he was able to kind of reach God and change his mind yeah. and I think that's what God wants on a daily basis from us he doesn't just want us being like okay cool God like whatever happens happens I have that mentality mentality a lot and I think that's good but we also need to be bold we need to be like okay God I want this to happen and here is why I want this to happen because I believe X, Y, and Z and if I feel like if you have a strong good reason for your goal or for the need in your life, I believe he will hear you. I like that. I hope that I hope that made that sense. That made so much sense. So guys, be bold. Be bold with be your prayers. Be bold with your prayers. Be bold with things that you want. Lex and I were just talking about the other day, huh? I'm like, babe, what do you want? She's like, blah, blah. I'm like, no, no. I'm so bad What about do that. you want? Because I'm Tell so me what you chill. want so, <laughs> so that we can work towards a goal. Yeah. Let's figure out where we, we want to be in five years. Not where I want to be in five years, where we want to be. It's a team effort. I think it's hard because I'm always like, well, I want to be where you want to be. <laughs> and you're like, I need an answer. That's yeah, so not yeah. an answer. I don't speak in English. I don't English. speak in words you're saying. <laughs> um, but yeah, be bold with your prayers and like confront God with the things that you want in your life. Obviously, your heart has to line up with what God wants for you in the sense that they have to be good things. Yeah. You can't you can't just want crazy, outrageous things. But but no dream is too big. No goal is too too out there. I feel like confront God about the things that you want in your life. He wants. He wants you to approach him for everything. Boom! Words of wisdom. wisdom. We, we love you guys so much. Sorry for this vlog coming up late. Uh, we didn't have any internet uh, or or uh, a space to edit yesterday because we were doing um, some stuff. So, um, yeah. Well. Hope, hope you like it. Hope you like it. Love you guys. More to come. And remember, as always, please comment below with any prayer requests. We're constantly praying for you guys. We should all be praying for each other, um, and man, it just, it's weird to say it tickles my heart. It tickles my heart <laughs> every time I see all these prayer requests because it's just like, I it's love awesome. this. And then and then when people comment below and they're like, I'm praying for you, blah, blah, I'm like, oh, I love it. this beautiful. is so great because this is what it's all about. This is what, why we uh, Guys, we can do be world this. Changers together. This is why we do this. So world we should changers. all be world changers together. High five. Much love. And as always, chop liver! <laughs> ow, ow, my finger!